Welcome to the Top 10 Games of the Century, presented by Athletic Brewing, where we look back at some of the most exciting and important key wins in Harvard history. Today, it's number four, women's lacrosse winning the national championship in 1990. Entering the 1990 national championship game, the Harvard seniors came in with an impeccable resume. 49 career wins, an undefeated Ivy record, and only eight career losses. All that was left on that list was winning a national title. Coming off an NCAA runner-up finish in 1989, the Crimson were primed to go one step further, and all that stood in their way was the Maryland Terrapins in the championship game at Princeton. Harvard fell behind early as the Terrapins scored the game's first four goals. Midway through the first half, Julia French got Harvard on the board with her first goal of the day. Charlotte Jocelyn followed with another Harvard goal to make the score 4-2. After the Terrapins went back up by three, Becky Gaffney found the back of the net for the Crimson to make the halftime score 5-3. The teams traded goals early in the second half, and with 20 minutes to go, Maryland still held a 7-5 lead. That's when Harvard found the extra gear to turn the game. Jocelyn's second goal cut the Crimson deficit to one. Maryland looked to bounce back, but goaltender Sarah Leahy made back-to-back -back saves. First year Liz Berkeley nodded things up at seven with her first goal of the game. Just 37 seconds later, Jennifer Weiser put Harvard ahead for good. From there, the Harvard defense stood tall, holding off a Maryland charge and sealing the national championship with a leery save near the horn. The Crimson wrapped up a perfect 15-0 season and celebrated their first national title. Join us next week for game number three on the list of Harvard Games of the Century.